Oh, welcome back to Old Ridge. Um, I'm just sold off some more equipment. Uh, I'm just going to take this uh, back to the farm. Back on the correct side of the road. As you can see, we. I oh, just want to see how Phil's doing and get him started. I'll just tell him what we expect. He has had a couple of runs, but uh, I should just park in here and just run across to the BGA. Not run at my age. Because Phil, luckily for us, had a job cancelled so he can come and move our silage into BGA. BGA. And did you think, did you think I was quite athletic there, leaping over the fence? Mind you, can't get through, I'm getting too fat. Right, he's in the. Uh, he's in the shovel, so we better get him uh, going. Just uh, tell them to the show them the course we want run. I think this must be the one. Well, we'll find out. We'll, we'll watch him a couple of times. That's I don't trust him. It's just that uh, it's always easier if you watch him for a couple. There's not a lot in here to go, so we're, it's not going to take them very long, we hope. And then tomorrow we will be ready hopefully to start doing the uh, maze Let's shut this all off right. let's see how he, how he does here make sure he gets round we'll hop out we'll hop out and let him get on with we'll, Watch him from a safe distance. Uh, it's going to be a little bit of cash anyway back. We have been doing quite well. I uh, can't remember how, how much I told your shoe we, we got rid of. We got rid of one of the elevators. So, uh, we got rid of the uh, old muck trail and we're using what was a beat trail now for muck. Basically, I decided we're going to use. Let's get this right. Bates and Davis to do our beat carting away. We only want a trailer from the field to the to the dump, and that will be a dump in the field rather than uh, taking it back to the yard. Yeah, he's okay, so we we'll, we we'll just get back to to our tractor and take that home. Well, no, I ain't gonna take it home. I'm gonna hook that up. Uh, to the uh, that new tra that little trailer, this is going to look a bit stupid. I'll we'll hook it up to there and go and do my fruit and veg. Oh, my fruit anyway. I cut no veg. Oh, I won't save myself legs. I should have thought about going to check him out before we got this far. Never mind. But. Just a little bit of a shock from BP. He uh, just pulled me up and told me to check my uh, loan with the bank if the bank still got the uh, cash. Let's get rid of that F1. Because he uh, has just had his sold to um, Crawford Brown's company or one of Crawford Brown's companies. And uh, he's a little bit concerned because, as you also know, Crawford Brown has a building company, and they are desperately looking for land around here. As you remember, I managed to stop um, Cuthbert from selling that, that far field, and he's put that down to fruit, and it, which he says it turned out rather well. And I have no reason to disbelieve him. So we got in close enough. Yes, this looks a bit odd, but uh, this works. This is a cheap way out because I haven't got a bother than about a separate truck to 
to pull this stuff. We only use it once a year. It seemed a bit silly to have a a truck just for that. Oh my God, this way. Or a juice, yes. Oh, and before I could get mother-in-law also called me. Oh yeah, but get back to the bank. I did check with our bank. I got to my bank, and they still hold the papers for mine. And they had said they will. They're not selling off my my debt to anybody else. They're going to hang on to it. Well, I, but because we're with different banks, uh, BP and myself, I just could be at my bank is a little bit more uh, community minded. It's it's a big bank, but not one of the really big guys. I think he's with one of the biggest in the world. Right. Oh, we'll start off with our plums. There's nothing like doing your plums first. Yes, and the other thing I was going to mention is mother-in-law. As I told you, into this uh, gaming and what have you, and uh, that game she's got, uh, Farm and Sim Simulator 17 or something she calls it. I don't know why it's been 17 issues. Oh, I wouldn't have thought you need 17. Well, anyway, she has uh, said there's another new game on the way. Now, cattle and crops, I believe, but the, don't really take it all in. But there's a, there's a site she's a member of, uh, PCSG.UK, I think she said, but sound like a lot of cowboys to me. Um, but they got a, they're going to be running it, or they are going to be running a competition starting in December to win early access cattle and crops, full access cattle and crops. And all you've got to be is a member of the gr uh, site and post on a certain forum when it goes live. But uh, I bet you know, mother in law. <coughs> She might be a spinner mere yarn, you never know. But I just thought I'd pass it on if anybody is interested. Oh, this has gone quite well. Oh, and I haven't seen what Kylie's up to. I better get her starting. Uh, looks like she's finished here. I'll just move her. On to where else she's got to go, and I'll just check that. I bet she'd be glad to take a day off. Uh, drawing what we got in there. But all these have been harsed now. There's the beat in there. Well, she ain't started on that yet. Where is she anyway? Ah. Just finished five. Ah, she's done five and six. And she, no, she hasn't done six yet. I'll just get her to, just get her to move over onto six. Let's come around the outside the field. Just put an alfalfa in, ready for the... Uh, Winter, so we've got a cover over the ground for the winter to stop the soil erosion. And also, come the late winter, early spring, we can either plough it back in and we'll put on the uh, organic fields, we'll plough it back in. And we better just see where she's got to go there, six. Just give her the uh, coordinates. Well, she's perfectly capable of doing this herself. Oh, it's now two six metre ones in there. I wonder which it is. Well, she can only get in a complete muddle in there. Yeah. 
Let's put her in there and see what happens. Not too worried how well this is actually covered, it's just as long as we get some coverage on it. I'll just watch her again for a, a little bit before I go back to my throat. I should have more than enough seed in there to do this, I think. I've got a feeling this is the wrong one. I think we should have put her onto the other course. But we'll see. So once she gets off this small bit, we really could do a three metre cedar just for these two fields. But more expense to buy yet another cedar just for a small amount of work. As you know, we got rid of the nine metre cedar. I think we might as well use this then mess about with a, an extra cedar in stock which we don't really want oh well we, we'll leave her to it she, she can mess about with that to her heart's content right I think what we do is we go we take this load up there then we come back for the other roll there would do this in eight trips I should think might just want to mow this grass down a bit it's getting a little bit long in here we can see Darren in the shop and see what he's been up to Oh, we're already up to 32,000. We are actually getting through the uh, problem with our finances nicely now. I told the bank how well uh, what we were doing to get their money back, and, it, and I actually made a stupid promise we get it back a year early. So basically, we've got to get it back next year. And the next harvest, we, sh we need to be back with just our normal overdraft. 200,000 max and no loan don't mind just using the standard over draft because we, we budget for that but this loan of course it's a little bit uh, fierce very much when they want to keep a hold of the uh, ticket on this with the amount we're paying now, oh, Darren, you want to get the grass cutter out here, boy. It's getting terrible around here. Oh, there we are. We'll get that in. in term. This was this, I can actually get in there easier. I haven't got to worry about backing in. Which, with my reversing skills, is a plus. I just wonder what this trailer would look like on the back of the JCB. Oh, and I've got one other little thing I promised the uh, stew baits I'd do a leap for them. So uh, before the end, try and remind me to do a leap. I'll do it on the bike, I think, rather than take a tractor over there. I used to leap it a lot when I had the little pickup, the uh, environmentally friendly pickup. That I had a fuel cell needed replacing and it was just too expensive. Very nice bit of kit but just too expensive on the sp you want the spares because they were so far up my boat. The fuel, things like the fuel cells were almost specially made for it. So uh, that had to go some time ago now. Let's come down this side. Yeah, so BP uh, a Friday could be falling in the clutches of uh, Crawford Brown, so he's got to make 
that wood harvest worked and the cows are doing no better for any of us. The milk prices are still way low. He was saying about the uh, payment for taking fields out of production and uh, getting paid not to produce milk. I, I'm not a great lover of the system. I'm old fashioned. I like my private land here unless I I need to make it fallow for a year to rest the soil. I like to have something growing in the field. I try to look after my wildlife around the edges and make certain the headlands are not sprayed where possible and also make odd areas which we're not going to uh, farm. Like the 12, end of 12, I will be doing some work on there, but some trees in there and some hedges up there just for the bird life. Give them a little wood. It's not big enough to do anything with. And I said, it's not big enough to do anything with, I'm not going to do anything with it. I think what we're going to do with Kylie, when she's done that one, we'll get her over onto uh, four and seven, and she can do those. I shan't bother. I may just uh, shove some fertilizer on as well, but uh, we'll get to do four and seven with the alfalfa. I don't know if she have quite enough in her. Hang on, she may do. She may have enough to do those two as well. Oh well, that's another load. This will be the plums done. I just hope that, uh, that, that they can all get taken. If not, I'm going to have to abort early and come back and finish it off later when it can take what's on the trailer. <laughs> you only have limited uh, chill room to put this stuff in. Oh, she's getting on there quite well. She, she's on the final headland. There'll be big bits missing, but uh, again, I'm not going to worry about that. Not for alfalfa. Especially that will just be ploughed straight back in on some of the other fields. One, I should imagine I will actually forage that. Eleven, I will put alfalfa in, but that again will be ploughed in. We need to get assess uh, organic fields. 12 will have a file button which may or may not go into the BGA. We're going to try and keep the BGA loaded next year, then I'll have to have a look again and see if I've worth a while to do the actual work to keep that going. coming back to us. That's looking good now. Come up to 50,000. Uh, took all that. One of these crops is normally, or one of these fruits is normally more than uh, more than I've wanted here. So now oh, she's finished. I'll get it back to three before I run it down to the next uh, field. Tomorrow after the uh, forest forage harvest of the maize, I'm off to a council meeting, and where I will have a word with uh, Crawford Brown just to see what uh, he's up to. He likes to pull, or he likes to try and upset me, and he knows that uh, BP and myself are good mates, and he will love to. Uh, get at me a bit that he's going to take over BP's farm but if the worst comes the worst I think a load of us will chip together to help <coughs> to help him <coughs> excuse me 
help him out to get him over the thing if we can. I can't do too much of because myself at the moment I'm still uh, still got rather a lot of debt. Right, let's go and have a look. At four and seven, we have a look at four first. I think we have enough to do both of these. I was thinking about grass and most of these fields, but uh, just for the winter, but I think alfalfa is almost cheaper, it's easy, and we can use the crop two ways. Gra well, grass we could, but the BGA won't take grass silage, and I'm trying to cut down the grass silage I'm using because of the greenhouse effect on the cattle. Alright, let's have a look here, get rid of that. No idea where it is, but well, one way to find out. Oops, it's down this side somewhere. It's going to come out of cab, I don't like doing like this, but... Uh, I can't see it. Oh, it's dry to water. We've got some weed in here. But isn't that. Ah, oh, that's here. Well, that's handy. Because I turned the markers off. Well, I'll let her get on with it. And we've still got to plow. Finish plowing that grass in. Over on 14, and that will say go on to production next year. I'm going to get as much production as I can for the best, best price as I can. Fifty-four thousand. Oh, we might. He might be able to pay off another sixty, seventy thousand. Well, mean we will keep a roof over our head for another year. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one load of cherries and take a load of apples, and just see which is actually producing more on a row. It will tell me then which one to do last, which is the one to produce the most. Because I'm going to have to keep some on the trier if that's producing too much. I haven't actually, oh, I was talked to Justin this, I think this morning and he, he's going well, he, and we've got cause Bob's funeral which I can't get to but mother-in-law's going from Bob's take now and that's actually t tomorrow so I'm going to be looking after myself, that should be fun, 5-4 there, yeah, alright, try and remember that. Well, we get two thousand pound a bucket load from uh, the, for the BGA. So it isn't much in there. It's only half a only half a bunker. I'm hoping to get a couple of two bunkers out of that top field at least. But this is a this is a period of reorganisation. Especially as we also got to find the money for, for the work during the winter, which are already booked for, so we need to get ourselves re in reasonable state before then.
tell you what, we do one. We do one apple, then I'll go and do that leap just to prove it. the old boy still got it. Fire the bike up and uh, head for the humpback bridges. Well, I used to have a leap those in the say a little pickup. It used to fly. Well, the thing was quick. Frighteningly quick, uh, quick at times. Did so I uh, take the wife's uh, Volkswagen, but she wasn't too keen on the Beetle having to fly. She won't let me drive it very much. I can't understand why. He's got another, another load in the, at the bunker and Carly's still got half a tank of seed. As you see we're all interconnected so we can see what we're all doing. It's all little gizmo in the cabs which uh, shows out on on a little display we're all, we've all got which my son got for us. He's trying to drag the old boy into the... Well, he reckons he's trying to drag me into the 20th century, let alone the 21st. I think he's got a hell of a job. The bees are working. Brings us a little bit of money in the bees, not a lot. Every little helps, they say. That's it's five four last time on it, so we see what we've got this time. I think it's going to be apples, then the other. But I will do that leap. I'll we'll probably end up in the hospital, which will uh, won't help matters a lot. My wife will call me a silly old fool. Mother-in-law will want to see what money she's going to get out of me to buy more computer kit. In fact, I don't think anybody would really miss me. Well, Paul and Carly might for a while, they'd have to do all the work. Even then, I don't know if they'd miss me. No, I've got to talk to you about uh, the shop, which we want really, but uh, Darren has definitely decided to enlarge the premises. And he's going to get that work done this winter. It's, it's uh, turned into a little gold mine for him. And it helps me out because it gets rid of. It gives me a better price for most of my goods than I could get generally. Like the meat get a far better price from the shop we sell it uh, he apparently, apparently sell a lot of it now online with a picture of a smiling farmer I don't know who's got to do that Hardly, I think actually he uses a picture of Kylie I hardly know to smile Oh yeah, it's gonna be. Uh, be the cherries are gonna be last to go. In fact, I'll go back and do some of the apples. I think. We only just do a half full this trailer. Oh, 
across. Some people said, well, why don't we ever see any cars parked in the car park of the shop? Parts. I think so a lot of it now is done uh, over the internet. He's doing a lot of trade there, especially with the stuff he put down as heritage meats. He says the beef has gone really well. I was doing it such as I suck out my flask. And I've got to get the class up to the Jordan in the workshop to get him to look at that header. I think I mentioned it's been playing up a bit. I just need him just to give that the one to. I just hope we don't have to replace it. Chad would be hoping we do so he gets some money out of it, but uh, Chad isn't getting my money if I can help it. There's not only many of these left by the time we've done here. I think we have about two, two left to pick from. Yeah. Oh, that's a few more. There's another couple up ahead there yet. Not going to quit on it. Thought it'd take some time. Alright, so we've got well, three. Oh, we've got three left to go. Three and a half uh, trees. I wonder how you get a half tree. That's Norfolk for you, boy. I'm still taking a chance there's no traffic about, you may uh, notice. But it looks better now we've got the fields have been sown. Uh, they all have to be uh, ploughed come the early spring. We plant, start planting early spring. Early spring and spring, possibly the beak going in summer. And it looks like she's done again. It's got 31%, I wonder if that's enough to do seven. I'll set this off tip and I'll go and see her, then I'll go back to the farm and get the bike. Oh look, that's 75,000, almost 76. Now the money transfer, well mind you, I've got to transfer some money to Bates and Davis for the beat transport. Oh. She likes taking, uh, likes taking the chance. Stop. Up within the go as much as close to the edge as we can to go out here. At least he's finished the right side. I'm going to grasp some of this edge of this field where it doesn't, uh, it doesn't take the uh, seed just to make it look a bit neater oh, I'm going to try and see how far we can get on this next one 31% may be enough to get round if not we're going to have to buy some, we're soon have to buy some more seed I know the, the seeds for the uh, Seed crops we're putting in the uh, two lots of organic barley and the one lot of organic wheat. We haven't got to buy the seed. That's been supplied. Let's see, this is seven. 
this might be this one. So I uh, just try that. Uh, oops. I think I better just put the uh, wide point in. <laughs> The well, isn't too bad, that's a little bit short on the drinks, but I need a good boost. We might even double ply one of these. Right, let's get back to the. Uh, oh, I'll see how Phil's doing. Let's hop out and have a look. That's it halfway through it he will finish that off today I'm convinced on that this is no longer sharing a shed with anything Ah, oh, listen to that roar. I don't know how fast this thing will go. I've never really tried it. Well, I have tried to play, but uh, as far as I say, I've had a good wife here and I will get an air full again. She's not overly keen on me still having a bike, but uh, she seems to think I'm a silly old fool who will come a crop at some point. Oh, I tend to agree with her. Let's get rid of that again. <sighs> I think what we do is we do is leap, and it would be a good a place as any to end this one. We'll come back and finish off the jobs on screen. For yet another episode on day 101. So it was no coming, there's no cops about. When we get on the road, before we hit the bridge, I will come out. I will do a distant shot from behind. Uh, we took off, it's not quite as fast as the uh, not as fast as the uh, pickup used to be. It used to hit 60. There's only a small engine. And it's badly in need of a service. We could get it on the road, we'd be laughing. And one on the saddle. Yeah, 46, 47 now. And with that, I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. If you like what you saw, please leave a like. If you're not a subscriber and wish to see more of the mayhem, which is Aldridge Farm, it's an ever-evolving story based around myself, our BPU on his farm, and numerous other characters. Uh, please subscribe. Um, any comments, questions, queries, or just generally want to take the juice, uh, feel free. Um, Big enough and ugly enough to take it.
Oh, with that, it's uh, Mammon's turn. Cheerio for now. Cheerio.